that's no glory and mister that is welcome back to our channel we're glad to have you here with us this is going to be a Walmart slash big R's big R's is like a farming fleet wouldn't you say mm -hmm. like a Blaine's farming fleet so if you're familiar with that and if you're not familiar with that then I'm sorry I can't help you <laughs> just just saying you know it, it, they sell a lot of garden kind of like stuff. A, a little bit like a Lowe's, a little bit like a, you know, Home Yeah, they Depot, sell garden stuff, smaller. farm stuff, but they yeah. also sell clothing and home decor and, yeah, so. A little bit of everything. But it's called Big R. So let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, we're going to do Walmart first. Sure. All right. We remember the prices on some things and some things we don't remember the prices on. So, go to your local Walmart and find out for yourself. Just saying. Nah. <laughs> so, we love the, I love, at least I do, I love the Prairie Farms brand that Walmart carries. And I don't know that all Walmarts carry no, that no, because no, no it's a local, it's a local dairy. Yes. Yep, it's a local thing here. It's a local here. dairy here. So, their prices are a lot cheaper on the Prairie Farm products. So we have, I like the caramel iced coffee of the Prairie Farms. So I got myself one of those and I think it was $2.94. And here is a, a light sour cream, great value. It was $1. Because if you remember, I had to throw away that other one from Aldi's. I'm just saying. <laughs> Got myself another Lando Lake Cinnamon Sugar. I like this on my toast in the morning. So, got another one of those. And it was two something. Sorry, don't remember exactly. Got two more of the biscuits. One is the buttermilk, one is the butter. Alrighty, that's the great value. They were $1.06 a piece. Alright, they had the creamer in the amaretto again. And like I told you guys in the past, it's hard to find the amaretto one. Mm -hmm. So, found it again, got myself <clears throat> another one. And I want to say it was 290 something. Something like that. Almost 3 bucks. So, there you go. Got myself that. Been craving some onion rings. We got their brand. And I don't remember how much they were. But if you guys have ever had their that particular brand, their brand, the Great Value, let us know if they're any good. First time for us. Okay, this is something that's kind of cool. It's new to us. We showed them And uh, I took pictures and I posted it on my Instagram. So if you follow me there, you would have seen the pictures before the haul. Now... Heinz has come out, we we really like Heinz ketchup, okay? And I like um, Hellman's mayonnaise. But this I like... the first one we found. Yeah. I like the mix together. Sometimes ketchup and mayonnaise. And we hauled this one a really long time ago. Heinz had come out with the mayo chup. If you remember that, it's where it's ketchup and mayonnaise together. So, And we, we had no idea that they made a, diff a different one. And we really like this one. As you can see, we've been mm -hmm. using it. So this is the new ones. This one is Cranch. It's ketchup and ranch dressing together. So it's called Cranch. <laughs> There you go. Haven't tried it yet. Looking forward to it because I like both those things. How they'll be together, I have no idea. But like I said, they were $2.94 a piece. Then they had this one. This one I'm not wanting to try. He wants to try it. Mm -hmm. So it's the <clears throat> mayo cue. It's mayonnaise and barbecue sauce together. Mayo cue. <laughs> so there you go. Something new to us. Next. <laughs> yeah, we were quite, we were quite, quite fascinated by them, so we had to try them. All right, got a extra large dozen of eggs. Ah, uh, they were like eighty-eight. Yeah, they were eighty-eight. Yeah. All right, got myself some chicken wings. <clears throat> I like chicken wings. Him, he'll take them or leave it. You know, he doesn't 
really care for them. I do. I don't like them hot. I just, I like to dip mine in ranch. So I might be trying this, uh, you know, this cranch. <laughs> I don't know. But it's fully cooked honey barbecue seasoned chicken wings. New recipe, it says, and it's the Great Value brand. And I want to say it was six dollars and yeah they weren't they weren't ridiculous it's, it's a pound a pound and six ounces so there you go for that and we started buying we used to get the deli uh white american cheese but we tried this last time for the first time and it's not bad mm -hmm. so we got another one because it was i think a dollar 88 was a lot less for a pound than, and that is one pound we have been on a clam strip mm. kick here lately. You know, we're sitting at home when we don't go out on our, we call it our days off. When we, to, our days off to us is when we get to stay home and we don't have to run the roads for either doctor's appointment, errands, or picking up for the food pantry and dropping it off. You know, that's a day off for us. So like on Sundays, Thursdays, we usually Thursdays, get... Thursdays, Fridays, and Sundays are our three days we, we try to stay, to stay home. <laughs> Let's up. But not this Thursday because I got to go get a CT scan and yeah. a Doppler. And... So anyway, we got the we like to sit at home and then for a snack he'll heat these up the clam strips. They so are we'll... a little pricey, but man, are they good! Oh yes. So that's our little we splurge. snack. Yep, we that's have. our splurge. And how much are they? I don't even remember. Uh, five ninety-seven. Okie dokie. I'm done over here. Oh, are you? Okay. Then that's why I grabbed that. I think that's it. So there's yours. Mm -hmm. We'll here's show mine. them together. Okay. We got some potato chips. Regular and barbecue. Great value brand. So there you go. <laughs> <laughs> and they were, I want to say a dollar. A dollar, I think. Yeah, a dollar. A dollar a bag. So, and that's the great big bag. That is the 18 eight ounces so not bad and oh last but not least yes I can't sneak out of the hall without getting a something you know that I always I buy that. and he picked this one it's mm -hmm. so pretty it's got so much <clears throat> iridescent in it it's salon perfect nail polish look at look at it look at the sparkle in that what I have on right now, I put the unicorn one on. That's the one I had bought before. It's the unicorn sparkle one. And well, I put it over the metallic maroon one that I also had hauled not too long ago. So I put both those on together. But I really like that light pink one. And what's the name on it? It's called Oh No Hunty. Mm -hmm. It is H-U-N-T-Y. Oh, no, hunty. <laughs> so, there you go. That was two ninety eight. Now I think we're done. Oh, we're going to do big R's, oh, we yeah. said. We're not done, Psych. Let me take that back. Nope, not done. Psych, now let's go into, B, into big R's. They had a big clearing section as soon as you walk in, and you know that just sucks us right in. So I found this Ocean Spray Cran Grape. It's 100% vitamin C, 64 fluid ounces, and it was one dollar. You can see, I don't know if you'll see the one dollar there, but I got myself that. And they also had a great big 64 ounce apple juice, Old Orchard, and it was one dollar. Mm-hmm. Then they had this three pack, okay? This is going to be expiring here the end of Oops. April. Yep, he had hit you guys. Sorry about that. This uh, expires the end of April, but we've said many, many times before, for those who may not know, and you know, we'll let inform you now, but all the dates that are on things are a sell by date. They want you to sell it. They want the the consumers to use it, buy it, and use it by that date. But that date is not written in stone. Everything you can use beyond that date. Especially okay? canned goods and things like that, they go way past. Mm -hmm. So and vacuum sealed. 
I mean, there are certain things you can't. Oh, come right. on. Give me a break. You know, like milk, you know. Yeah. Of course, milk you can't use way past the expiration date because it'll be bad. But you can surely go a day or two past it. We've done it. No, nothing wrong with that. I mean, you'll know. But just by smelling that. Right. But this will be good way past the end of this month in April. And it's the Heinz three pack. It's the ketchup, the relish, and the yellow mustard. And we paid, there you go there, what's it say? 99 cents for the three pack. That's an awesome buy. Another really good buy and this never ever ever goes bad. It may get hard, yeah, yeah. but for moisture or yeah. whatever, but... This never goes bad. Sugar, it, it, if it does anything, it'll just get hard, but it never goes bad. And four pound, and it was only 75 cents. Good deal. Can't beat that. All right, Damn, Brad, you keep it... <laughs> well, <I'm... laughs> he keeps knocking you guys around. All right, um, then I think last, I'm looking around, last but not least... No, yeah. no least. Okay, well, you're doing it together. We got two okay. items. You know that I bought that birdhouse, that bird bath that is solar for outside for the birds, you know? Well, we'll put that out. We will, and a lot of you want to see a picture of it. We will show you the whole front yard when it's all said and done with the flower beds done and everything, It'll okay? Be a while. It's going to be a little while because it's just now Look the weather's back getting at some nice. Of our other videos last year. And but I want to put next to the bird bath, I want to put a shepherd's hook and I want to hang this from the shepherd's hook and put bird feed in it. It was $3.99. So I'm going to hang it by that. And then as you can see, it's just a feeder that I will fill up and the birds will have a heyday. It was normally $5.99 on sale for $3.99 and this was $5.99 on sale for $3.99. And it is, how many pounds? Heavy. I think it's a 20 pound. I think so, yeah, but it's heavy. Mm -hmm. It's so 20 there's pounds. The, there's the bird seed. A wild bird seed. Yep. So there you go. We're going to make the birds happy. And instead of putting it out back like I had planned, we're going to put it out front. And because Simon and Freya like to hang out in the front bay, big bay window that we have out front. Um, picture window and so that way they'll have a little entertainment when the birds come around mm -hmm. their own little sideshow all right guys gotta sorry go. i kicked you around a while you know two or three times <laughs> sorry not sorry huh <laughs> we love you guys you know that all right we'll see you in the next video remember toys let go like god no guts no glory and mr that is god bless us all see you bye, bye.